don't have a job. It's all our fucking money. That's why I'm in a 50% tax bracket, you fucks. 35% of my paycheck. So what do you think of the price of fucking chicken eggs? 35% of my paycheck and then 15 cents on everything else I buy. Get the fuck out of here. Hey, Tom, what do you think about the chickens? Is there something going on with the feed? Yeah, it is the feed because my niece's chickens haven't laid eggs. She said, oh, yeah, I don't know. Or chickens ain't laying eggs. Well, they got some organic... Uh... They slow down in the winter a little bit, but yeah, not, not like not zero eggs. So we got flying saucers. <laughs> uh, <laughs> We got the Ukrainians running out of bullets. We're talking about all kinds of crazy shit right now, Steve Spencer. We're on our way up to the uh, the freedom uh, movement of uh, in Toronto. The big protest that's happening at noon, and we're on a making great time. We're gonna get there, but we're just talking about some shit you guys got to listen about. We don't call it conspiracy theories anymore. We call them spoiler alerts. Spoiler yeah. alerts. Ah. We got mustard gas in fucking Ohio. <laughs> We got UFOs. <laughs> the Ukrainians are running out of bullets. What a shit show. What a shit show. What a shit show. Chickens ain't laying eggs. Now, I don't believe in conspiracy theories. No. I don't. It's like a two-week window for your conspiracy theory. Yeah, a two-week window for a conspiracy <laughs> theory. I fucking oh, yeah, love that, it. That was right. We're talking about the jabs. Okay, and uh, the wreckage it's caused a lot of people along oh. the way. These two guys I'm with, they uh, never got the job. I ended up getting it twice, but I feel fine. You know, I get four hours. Uh, I'm more productive now in life than I ever was. I get four hours sleep if I'm lucky. Well, hopefully you got the Go woke, go broke. Hopefully you got the Go woke, go broke. <laughs> no sleep till Brooklyn. You should get a shirt, mate. I got the placebo. I'm okay. People are tuning in. Good morning. Good morning. So what are we else we're going to talk about here? Don't get silent on me now. God. Fucking price of gas. Driving a fucking truck. Freedom ain't free. It's going to cost me fucking $80 in gas. Oh, yeah, but thank God for the no, reserves. Yeah, thank God for the reserves. And there's one coming to Leamington. Man. Cheap smokes and fucking gas. Leamington. That's fucking mint. Yeah, there's a, yeah, there's a, yeah, Leamington. Yeah, I'll be hitting that fucking thing like crazy. And the marina, too. That's all a calder. That's a call. Yeah, yeah, fucking right. Be jerking off all the way. Well, they fucking... charge a sixty cents a liter more because you're in your boat. It'll yeah, be it'll boat be worth it, it'll be worth me fucking go, going to uh, Leamington yeah, for gas for filling real. up. Yeah, it will be. You bring your jerry cans, go ape ship bananas. I got a hitch for my trailer to put the tanks through. No, Steve Spencer, they retracted that the other day. Joe Biden came out and said, uh, "No UFOs." That they no not that they weren't Chinese spy planes. No. What I think it was was a 15 or 16 year old kid playing uh, playing games right. with a ten dollar balloon he got on Amazon right. and fucking in thirty dollars worth of helium and he sent it up. Right, let's check it out. No, it was. They think it might have even been just a couple weather balloons. Shannon, Brassico. Yeah, we're making our way to Toronto. Only the one was a Chinese balloon. I'm gonna bring you guys a live shit. The way I see it, the truth. But what's going on? Uh, yeah, fuck Justin Trudeau. That's all I know. Fuck Justin Trudeau. That's all I got to say about that. What about that re report yesterday, Tom? What do you think of that? Yeah, yeah, sounds right. Hey, the report. War uh, measures act on innocent. What's his name? Justice. Is, was there too many hot tubs? Like, I no, don't get fucking. His name's Justice uh, Douchelow. Oh, yeah. Douchelow, not Rulo. Right, when you have the Prime Minister's fucking distant, inbred cousin fucking sitting on, right, right. as a judge, ruling on this. Right. What, we all we all knew what to expect. It's like January 6th. Tell me some more. Yeah, they're trying to tell us it's like January 6th. Fuck. I was in Ottawa too last year. Too many hot tubs, too many bouncy castles. Call in the National Guard. You know what? I wonder if I send a bouncy castle with helium up there in the sky. That'd be hilarious. If, they, if they'll shoot it down for Put with a four hundred thousand dollar missile and the Fuck cost of the jet and the pilot. Four hundred thousand. Imagine that. Why wouldn't they just shoot shoot it down with bullets in a, like an F fourteen? Well, they got close enough to see it was unmanned, but they don't know what it was. F fourteen's. Are you joking me? You don't know what it was. Iran right? Iran caught a uh, a drone. That's how they got this technology. Uh, to fight the right this war, they and they use the net to catch it in the sky. Net what? Use the net to catch it in the sky. Yeah, they use the net to catch a drone. They re reversed, uh, engineered it, and they mastered it. And now the Russians are using that technology to fight the Ukrainians. So thank you. 
<laughs> there you go. Well, barely a fight, but yeah, sure. Yeah, I don't know what to make of the Ukrainian war. Uh, you got uh, the 57th shittiest army in the world. 53rd ranked army in the yeah, world. Yeah, 53rd ranked three army, army against the number world. three in the world. Yeah, yeah. they're winning. The, but the Ukraines are winning. Yeah. I heard they ran out of bullets. That's the only thing. Uh, yeah. And they need some. So if you want to support a good uh, a good cause, send all your bullets to the Ukraine. Well, we need them for our fucking revolution. I think he'll be dancing with the stars soon enough as soon as Putin Coming gets them. Soon. Right? Uh, I'm not a fan of Zelensky. I feel sorry for the Ukrainian the people that are caught. Yeah, the, yeah they, it's people. Zelensky. They, uh, Zelensky uh, banned the letter Z in Ukraine, so you have to call him Zelensky. Yeah, 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 because the Z is owned by Russia now, right? Yeah. Well, if you use a Z, that's their war. It was on the right? tanks. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So he changed his Get name. In my lane, man. At the same time, you fucking yeah. no indicator. Maybe Justin Trudeau will change his name to Justine. Justin. That's right. Using folks. him, her pronouns. <laughs> <laughs> So this is an interesting ride, I'll tell you. I wish I was videotaping it Nobody earlier. Who cares? Hey, wish we were videotaping it a little bit earlier. I shouldn't have told them I was videotaping it. Right, right, right. We knew. Right, so it is what it is. We're Love ranting. It. We're ranting. Roseanne Perry, hello. Paul Eternal, good morning. Monique Dupi. Four hello. Hours Who else is up here? We got Robert Egan. Those balloons released by... The one and only USA. It's to keep the eye on to something else. Yeah, Look yeah. over here. Yeah, oh, we don't hear anything, and I'm not a conspiracy Slide theorist. Yeah. But Slide when you got a chemical hand. train that derailed with a chemical uh, uh, oh my cart. God, like 10 different, te yeah. Yeah, uh, 10 of them, and they're oh burning, God. and then they yeah. come in and use, uh, what do they call that? Uh, totally toxic. What did what, what, what they use? Uh, a missile, and they call it a controlled explosion. Oh, they use... Um, um, Fancy words. Yeah. They, use, they, use a, they burned a hole through it with thermite. Yeah, they did. To light it on fire. Yeah, go figure. And uh, the environmental damage it's caused. Oh my God. Yeah. Okay. Be... And you don't hear Joe Biden speaking about it or the uh, EPA or any of them. Man. They got Aaron Brockovich is on it. Aaron Brockovich. Yeah. Oh, is she? Yeah. yeah oh. The real Aaron Brockovich. Yeah. Oh, the the yeah. real. I thought, yeah, the real one. I thought yeah. you meant the redhead no, actor. Uh, what's her face from? Uh, okay. <laughs> Julia, Julia Roberts. Roberts, yeah. She hijacked. No, the, yeah, uh, the real uh, the, the image of that. She's getting involved in it. Good. Aaron Brockovich. Yeah. You know what? The, the, look at the environmental she'll, damage. Yeah, she'll start that shit out fast. You know, the, and they show the spread of it. Uh, we're in a radius. In Windsor, almost to Toronto. There's a big circle. Pittsburgh, a radius of where this chemical. Yeah, it's like nuclear fallout. Yeah, it's, it's terrible. terrible. Yeah, it's like mustard gas in World yeah, War you know, I. I predict, I predict next year when everybody gets sick from the jab yeah, oh. that they're going to blame it on the train. They're going to blame it on the train. Yeah, blame it on the... Isn't that that cop from... They're wherever? going to blame it on the soul isn't, train. Isn't she the train, that cop in the States? <laughs> 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 they had a train going. Man. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they had the train on that cop. Uh, oh, that cop's was, boat. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, the gangbang train. Yeah, train. That cop, yeah. yeah I don't that, know her name. That was a distraction, too. Too funny, man. Too funny. That was a, actually a pretty funny distraction, if you ask Normally me. Normally, that stuff doesn't get out. Yeah, yeah that don't get out, yeah, right? Especially out of the police. Who cares? I really liked the video of the guy who went in to try and get a interview at that police station. Did you see yeah, that video? No. Oh, my God. I laughed my ass off. Yeah. Freaking clown world. He wanted to get arrested. He wanted to get arrested by her and handcuffed. <laughs> uh, <laughs> He's going I got off. A weapon in my pants. <laughs> so what are you gonna do? Yeah, uh, white noise. Tammy Dero uh, Deroche. One hundred percent. I watched that in uh, December when it came out on Netflix, and it's a corny movie about a train in Palestine, Ohio, right? That explodes and there's a big fucking dirt cloud. That's poisoning people. Conspiracy. And that was in December. <laughs> I'm not a conspiracy theorist. But that train did go off in Palestine, Ohio, last week. God, watch The Simpsons, watch, Yeah, man. watch The Simpsons. Oh, I'm God. just thinking that. For updates. Watch The Simpsons for updates. The, yeah, the skies are clear, Gerald, today. But you yeah, see those? There's some clouds up there. Man. It's particles, fine particles that'll yeah, get you. who knows, man. Yeah. That's... So... Yeah, that is funny, As Tammy. The roach. Doesn't float around as insulation sheets. It's a fine dust, man. Right? Like, yeah, you know, see 
you know, and, and here we got a government on both sides of the border that are fucking all about the environment. We got the Americans blowing up the Nord Stream pipeline, creating how that's much okay. damage yeah, that's okay. to the aquatic and in, in the air. Oh my God, everything, yeah. Okay? Terrible. And we got all this shit going on with the trains. Nobody cares. And nobody cares. You're not hearing about it in the news. Yeah. But our carbon tax is going to go up. Yeah. We're going to pay for it. Yeah, we clean more air than everybody on the planet. The Fuck. Boreal Forest runs through all of Canada, man. Cleans yeah. like 30% of the world. Ever. And they grew hemp. Hemp sucks in more CO2 yeah. oh. than any other plant on the planet. And it releases what? Oxygen. It's not rocket science. So you plant the your, fucking you're shit. Your part, and you know. use the shit, okay? Use the hemp for oil base, whatever you need for food, yeah. okay? Uh, the seeds. Probably could use it for a few uh, the fuel. Fucking chickens would love hemp seeds. You probably make these a lot of it. You yeah, can you make these a lot of it. You probably could, right? Yeah. It doesn't, yeah. You know, hemp's been around for years, but big yeah. oil got rid of it. They get rid of it. Yeah. Yeah. And that's a fact, Jack. We got 40 people this morning watching. I don't want to burn up all my data. I'm going to burn it all up in Toronto for you guys. Uh, I'm hearing conflicting stories about what's going to happen in Toronto. But I'm going to bring you the report live. The truth as I see it. From the mouth of the South. The man without a plan. The master of everybody's disasters. And hopefully there is no disasters there. But you never know. Yeah. Right? You got the uh, far right right that's going to be there. Antifa's always there somewhere starting I got shit. Bail money. Yeah. <laughs> These guys got bail money. I don't. Can we do a GoFundMe? I got bail money. You can't leave me in jail in Toronto. Not again. <laughs> There's a story behind that. So, Tom, tell us about the SARS since we went to SARS together. Well, I don't know. Uh, SARS, terrible disease, 10% death ratio. And uh, what did we do? We partied in Toronto with 500 fucking thousand people. Still alive. Oh, where did we stay? We Just stayed. Say no. we oh, the hotel that was in the hospital parking lot where the outbreak was. <laughs> yeah. And that's no lie. And that was a shithole too. That was a pretty. That was a shithole. Dundas yeah, West, Little Russia part of fucking Toronto. Yeah, I wrote a complaint for sure. I don't, did I get my money? Little back? Russia. I don't know, but yeah, that was a fucking <laughs> sketch hotel. In the bars we were drinking at down oh there too. God, I was like, holy yeah, fuck! What, what even was that? Ukrainians and fucking. It was weird, eh? It was. All right, but like I said, the, the motel, he said it. And I, oh, yeah, sketch. It was right next to the uh, hospital where the SARS outbreak <laughs> happened, and we went up there and mixed and mingled with 500,000 people, yes, and this was a deadly right. disease yeah, and concert. everything else, and guess yeah. what? I never even got a fucking sniffle. Yeah, yeah. Same thing in, in Ottawa last year, I and at the bridge, the Ambassador Bridge. I cried a little bit for the $5 bottles of water that were supposed to be free, but sure, sure. Fucking dying. I never. Hot. That was hot. Fuck yeah. I, I haven't been sick in four years. Five years. I haven't been sick since I went to Mexico 20 fucking, I don't know, 22 years ago. Yeah. Though I did have a headache and that backache for a day. So I don't know. Does that count? COVID? Yeah, sure. Well, we, used, we were talking about me down. when we were kids, we'd jump in the Detroit River and oh, there was so much sewer. human yeah, shit yeah, in there. It's a fucking sewer. You would oh, you would jump worse. you would jump in in the shallow spot and you'd be in the the garbage and the shit up to your nipples. All the chemicals from Zug Island. That's what made that. us oh, tough. My God, leaching into that shit. Ooh, yeah, you got a chrome coating. <laughs> yeah, we do, man. Or something, right? <laughs> well, yeah, we got all the minerals and, and vitamins we yeah. needed. Just oh, the minerals yeah, were yeah. aluminum, copper, you're, zinc, rust. Oh, your yeah. lead shielded. Yeah, lead, lead shielded. Yeah, hundred yeah, percent. Copper top. At, at fifty-two, I'm looking all right, eh, people? Yeah, pretty good. Less the hair, but yeah, we all got that. I problem. had the shot twice. Look at my eye. I, I got a, I got a lazy eye now. We're hoping for the placebo, but who knows, right? Well, uh, maybe if I get the third or fourth or That's fifth my shot, job. my, my, my eye might work again. Placebo. My buddy who works with me got it. Whoa, we paid for our vacation. Are you out of your mind, dude? Why do you think nobody here? We're in the pharmaceutical business. You know better than to think you're going to fucking ruin your life. And this guy retired from the pharmaceutical business. years, third largest company in the world, Catalan Pharmaceuticals. Now I can say whatever I want because I don't work there. What are they going to do, fire me? That's yeah, right. They never cut no corners or none. Come on, man. Like, man, I feel bad for the people that, yeah, listen to the government and all the doctors. Frankie Desjardins is watching. I'm just glad that I, I yeah, I'm glad I did. I mean, that's all Terry right. Lynn Nelson's watching. Randy. My wife. Asseltine's watching. And maybe you will be all right for now. Who knows, man? There's you, so many different shots, man. It's not even funny. Yeah, you know what? I, I just like the man. shot of uh, 
cc once in a while and shot a tequila <laughs> right uh, i got some jagermeister here in my flask it's in the center council probably should have put it in the trunk got the oh no flask. it's in front of my, it's in the front of my cooler man. but we're making a day trip we so we, we're shooting up no, there I shooting got my back Jagermeister. no i don't want it I'm driving maybe when we get there but you never know i wasn't paying i'm looking at my phone here yeah jagermeister could be like vancouver where i go there on vacation for for a week and i stay That's 18 months <laughs> Well, 16 of the months are in a jail somewhere. But <laughs> that we, don't count, does it? We brought bail money this time. <laughs> we brought bail money. <laughs> the wife will like that. Do they take credit cards? <laughs> Soupy Campbell. Morning, be safe. Are you headed to Toronto? Who's headed to Toronto? John Hart, you're already there. Where are we parking, John Hart? There's a convoy we just passed uh, yeah. around between London and Windsor. Yeah. That's on there. Are a, a few cars that are with the flags all headed to Toronto. Yeah, I rolled down the window and they see my mug. Six cars. It was the, the soup people from last week, uh, two weekends ago, down at the riverfront. <laughs> yeah, the Italian wedding soup. That shit was good, Don. Yeah, it is pretty good. Yeah, I like that. But my wife packed me some sandwiches, some bologna sandwiches. I got snacks. He's got snacks. We got water. We're all taken care of. We're just cruising. Sesame snacks. They're pretty good, man. Sesame seed ones. Just outside of Woodstock now. What's wrong with my left nostril? You got a hair. Is there a hair in here, guy? You didn't look in a mirror before you left the house? We're right here. Scissors. I got scissors right here. <laughs> Facebook Live. I'm a fucking savage. He's a mess. Where's the <laughs> you need to get the waxing done. Let's see. I can't yeah, see yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Let's you see. Need to see Akram. We got a mirror here somewhere. Yeah. Let's see. I told the wife to pick my nose, pick the hairs out of my nose. Damn it. Hey, buddy, I can't go anywhere. Work. He'd have the one Satan eye brown. Like, how do you that? Oh, there it is. Can you see it? You his, need a 4K camera. I, his out of the audience, thank you. The Don't bat worry. is out of the cave. Don't the worry, nothing's, nothing's going up my nose. Not this weekend. <laughs> Homie, don't play that game anymore at 52. I got to worry about, uh, what's that? that, what's that heart condition you get from the... Myocarditis. I gotta worry about that Coming now. Coming soon to a heart near you. But if it happens on the job and I die on the job, I get a little bit more money. For the wifey. Yeah, the wifey gets it all. She'll be excited. She'll be excited. I get nothing. I get stiffed. She'll be excited. Literally <laughs> stiffed in the morgue. Uh, <laughs> How can I laugh about something like that? Because it's funny. That is funny. It is what it Only is. Only because it hasn't happened. <laughs> it hasn't happened yet. 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 But many people will be sad on this Facebook. This guy with his yeah, hundred hours a week. I just want you. Like, I just want you guys to Facebook me live in my uh, in my casket. Say one last good thing about me. If happens. you can think of one. Yeah, if you can think of one. <laughs> Brad Curry, what's going down? Are you headed towards Toronto or Ottawa? Hey, Melissa. You're doing it all over, right? Eh? What's that? This. Yeah. It's Ottawa. Yeah, this is going on all over the place. If yeah, you can't Alberta, make it, you Toronto. can't afford it, we, we carpooled today. And uh, I'm so broke, I can't even go to the corner store. So we made bologna sandwiches and brought water. So broke, I could barely pay attention. Fuck, I'm so broke. I'm so poor that I had to jack off the dog to feed the cat. <laughs> I'm so poor <laughs> that I had to feed the cat to the dog. <laughs> We're so poor, we had to eat that dog. <laughs> it's in that's, the sandwiches. Now that's poor. Pamby Lucier, what's going on? I like that name. No relation. See, guys, are, it's going to be a wild trip. Like I said, I'm going to get my the people's grow with my phone and get some interviews because I'm out of the cells. Got to find out what the fuck's going on in Toronto today, and that's what I'm going to do. Dylan Fossett, how's things turning out in Ottawa? I know you're there. Woodstock. And I really wanted to come and see you in Ottawa, but uh, it's just not feasible. Toronto's where it is for me, anyways. Yeah. Are you doing Facebook lives uh, in Toronto, Toronto, or are you doing YouTube lives? I'm gonna go YouTube. So if you guys want to pay attention, Mouth of the South. Okay. Throw the link up there, Donnie. Uh, on your Facebook page. Yeah, on my Facebook page. Sure. Somebody's gonna put a link up here. Subscribe to this page and like it 
And I'm going to go YouTube live because right, I'm getting uh, onto a different platform. Facebook, you know, i got to watch what you fucking say on Facebook. Yeah, fuck like the word fuck. Uh, uh, not, you know what? If you film those doctors talking, they're not going to... Uh, oh, they no, I just, yeah, I, they I'm going to get yeah, some they, interviews of people. They won't run that. And uh, I just want to hear what what the big grievance is. Because there's a lot of them in this country. There's a lot of them. You don't know. I don't know where to start. You have to get on Twitter now. And where to end. Yeah, take your pick. Right. So there's so many. There's a scandalous government. One of the smallest countries in the world is going to save the planet with a carbon well, tax. Look at our fuck fucking taxes. Here, look at the Come taxes on. we're paying. Come on. You know, I make good I feel money. bad for the poor people after I paid five eighty nine for a bag of milk, man. Give me a break. The price of food. The price bad. of housing. Okay. Ridiculous. It's getting out of hand, folks. In a government that don't really give a shit. They don't. Now the price of gas came down a couple what a couple weeks ago. Price of diesel Some came of down. The largest natural resources in the world and we're getting raped. That's Come right. On, we got we got more we got more gold than China has rice. <laughs> oh, okay, man. and we got diamonds. We got it all here. We got oil coming out of it. Remember oil's we not got a fossil oil. fuel. It's on the planet. It's we got to get that oil pumped. Not from dinosaurs. It's not going to run out. If I'm where uh, Marco, Mass Mayor Liff, he is related. He's related to who? Should have took my niece's electric car. It would only take us seven, nine hours to get there. Daryl LeBlanc, good morning. Get out of bed. Get your coffee, India. So I don't want to use up all my data here. I'm just going to use up... Uh, links up. Hey? Okay? Links up. There, there's, up. there's a link there. Somebody just put up a link to my YouTube page. Subscribe to it. Hit notification. I'll be going live probably around noon to show you the show that's going to happen in Toronto. It's a biggins. You see lots of vehicles with flags headed towards Toronto right now. And we're outside Woodstock, but we've been seeing it since Windsor, right? So a lot of people are headed... To Toronto, a lot yeah, of people going. A lot of people good, going everywhere, really. Yeah. So Toronto's always a good turnout when you got four million people yeah. in the uh, Toronto GTA in that greater area, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, if only two percent showed up, that's a big party, folks. Yeah. You want to know what's going on down in uh, Winnipeg? Uh, Black Sheep Media. Black Sheep Media is covering Winnipeg. Yeah. So if you want to see what's going on down there, check it out. I'm not for the swastika flag at all. No. Okay, and I don't care who's, who's who is. Man. Well, I don't care who's Chris the flying. Friedland? It. Maybe. Chris, yeah, Christine Freeland, she's yeah, for maybe. it, but I'm not. Yeah, maybe her, her right? grandfather and all that family thing. Yeah, the world ones are going on today everywhere. So I don't know if Windsor has anything planned. Did you what, hear Windsor's got something it? planned and we're driving to Toronto? Yeah, fuck, let's go back. Uh, hey, we're already in yeah. Woodstock. No, I don't think there is anything, really. So, I don't know if Windsor's got anything going on. I know Toronto does. Yeah. So many police up in uh, in Ottawa right now that there's uh, more police than there are protesters. <laughs> That's not a joke. Yeah, I haven't seen that. So they put all their Try eggs it. in one basket and they uh, focused on uh, Ottawa... I think Ottawa was a Trojan horse for Toronto, Quebec City, and possibly Winnipeg. Yeah, Winnipeg. Right, so it is what it is. What, uh, Dylan, you, you're living in Ottawa. It doesn't sound fun? In Ottawa? And you live in Ottawa. So you're confirming it's, uh, it's, it's really... Not fun there? No. Laugh out loud. Well, fuck, Dylan. You're only four hours from Toronto. Jump in your vehicle now. You'll make it. Three hours from Toronto. It's a nice thing about where I live. I'm halfway to Ottawa. Or Toronto's halfway to Ottawa for me. I could get in, get out. Day trip, yeah. A million cops, Dylan said. Yeah, that's good. I wonder how Mr. Doug Forty's going to treat us today. They're all corrupt, and that's what it is. We need regulation.
and there is no Nazi flags in Winnipeg. Quit listening to Maverick. <laughs> he's he's nuts, Leo. Well, he's just bringing us the story, and I'm going to bring you this the story, and I hopefully don't see any Nazi flags. Because I eat Nazis for fucking breakfast. And I'm hungry. The mouth has got to eat. Right, Tom? Yeah. Yeah, fucking 100%. I eat fucking Nazis for breakfast. Who the fuck would do that? Oh, yeah. Paid Then I eat liberals for lunch. Oh, right. Trudeau's camera guy. He would do it. <laughs> <laughs> the Trudeau's camera guy. He would do it. Doug Ford's going to send somebody out there with a Nazi flag. I'm going to be hanging with his daughter in the protest. Yeah, see her? She's on our side. I know. It's weird, eh? Yeah. And Justin Trudeau's brother, stepbrother's on our side, too. She's not paid not to be, man. You know what I mean? Doug Ford's daughter was on the uh, the pro-cannabis yeah. side, too. Right? Trudeau's brother. And Trudeau's brother, stepbrother's on the yeah. pro-cannabis side. So, it's weird, eh? Yeah. Sounds like sibling rivalry in the families. Look at that color. That's weird, eh? It looks like it's plastic. He's Spend bringing... Jobs like that? It's pretty crazy. Rick's bringing bullshit, not awareness. Well, I'm bringing you awareness. Are you coming to Toronto, Terry Lynn? We'll see you there. Because I'm on my way. And it was a last-minute split decision last night. Yeah, yeah. Around right. 7 o'clock, we decided on it. We're going to go to Toronto. Later when he called me, man. I actually got my bulletproof jacket, my vest, my gas mask, and my uh, glasses. And you'll see me all decked out. Because I will take three rubber bullets to the face for freedom and a little bit of tear gas. I no, won't take get it for sure. I won't take four. I'll tell you that right now. Don't shoot me four times in the fucking face. I draw the line on that. That's when the gloves come off. <laughs> right? Tear gas ain't so bad. But the bur bulletproof vest? Face, yeah, not so much. No fun. problem. Fucking paintball's bad enough. The flak jacket. So it is what it is. Outside. Yeah, you're going to stay tuned, Dylan. Hopefully, uh, I can get the following over on the uh, YouTube. Maybe I can send a link when I go YouTube live. I can send it over to Facebook. Because I got a great following on Facebook. But let's get it over to YouTube, and let's get the shit going on YouTube, and I'll start doing some uh, some crazy shows out there. I only speak the truth even when I'm lying, and that's not a that's not a joke, folk. And you're gonna see it. You're gonna see it live. Yeah, you'll share it out there, Dylan. I don't know how Rick or anybody else does it. Uh, do they got multiple uh, feeds going at the same time? I don't know. But I'm going to try and figure it out. DK, morning. Lisa, morning. I'm going to kick some ass. You're going to want to go back and watch this. So like I said, we got UFOs in the sky. We got poisonous gas over top of Ohio, Pittsburgh, Windsor, Detroit, all the way to Toronto. <coughs> and my throat really hurts. What else we got going on? The Ukrainians are running out of bullets. Imagine that. Is that what they said? That's what they're saying. They are uh, crying to the rest well, of the world. They well, need some more bullets. Well, when you sell them all. Yeah, when you sell them all to, uh, to have Ethiopia. Right? Somalia, probably, yeah. Yeah. And that's been going on for a long time. Justin Schneider. Yeah, Dylan, you're new to this stuff. D, you're new to this stuff. So I'm picking up a few. I'll pick up a lot more as soon as I hit Toronto here in about, what are we, 45 minutes away? We're making great time. I wonder if there's somebody's... Uh, I didn't sleep. Wi-Fi there he can log into. What's that? I wonder if there's somebody Wi-Fi you can log into in Toronto. Free so, Wi-Fi. So like the you're going to want to go back and watch the beginning of this because somebody in here in the chat said I had... A hair growing out of my nostril, and I was a savage, and I picked it right out of my nostril like that. Right into my car. <laughs> yeah. DNA. He's got my DNA in his car. Uh-oh. -uh. 
<laughs> it's better than on the crack of your ass. Yeah, true. <laughs> Now that's some funny shit. But I don't want to use all my data. I only got 17 gigs. Is that a lot, Donnie? I, that's a good, I, that's I, good, I, I guess. I don't know, man. I, you should run your videos in like 480 instead of high def. It'll save you. See, I know nothing about this shit. It'll save you some data. I think you went through that pretty quick down in Ottawa. It'll save you some data. Yeah, Ottawa was, I don't know, Ottawa. Yeah, I was going through it. Fuck. I had to get a GoFundMe just to just to keep my data going. <laughs> so I want to thank everybody out there that, that that contributed to the GoFundMe, and the government didn't even stiff me. They already seized my bank accounts for other things. <laughs> Wasn't for a GoFundMe. So I can laugh about that. Oh Rachel, oh Rachel Dion, hey De De Daglio, D'Angelo. And her son plays for, I'm just outside of Guelph right now. And her son plays for Guelph, actually. Football. Kane. Kane calls me Uncle Leo. And Kane's going to the CFL or the NFL. Greg Long, Stacy, Janice. Morning to you guys. Hopefully I can ruin your breakfast. In your morning coffee, but I think I got diarrhea from this chemical spill in uh, in Ohio. That's a symptom. Yeah, man, it ain't that far away, man. Really, I'm wearing a diaper. I'm just gonna shit myself because I want to bring you guys a story live until the data runs out. Why you want to run out of data? I don't want to run out of data, but I. I don't want to stop either to take a shit, so I'm wearing a Depends. I'm 52 years old. I'm allowed to wear Depends. Yeah. Right, Tom? Sure. Sure. Leakage. <laughs> Leakage. <laughs> Who ain't shit their pants out? I, I'm holding my diarrhea till I get to uh, Queens Park so I can hang a rat. <laughs> right, on, right, on, right, on, right on fucking Queens Park. Here you go. Whereabouts are we? Woodstock. No, we're... Well, we're past. Wolf. Wolf area. Oh, dead raccoon. Stop. Pick uh, it up. Uh, poor raccoon. That's dinner. Come Rascal. on, man. You see the price of meat at the fucking stores? Yeah, right. I'm ready to start eating roadkill. I could... Eat I could... Can <laughs> I could fill my freezer from the ride from Toronto to Windsor. Yeah, for real. Now, that's some hillbilly shit. Yeah, that's crazy. Crazy. But I'll tell you, if we were... Uh, in, in some other places in the world, we'd be roadkill. We'd yeah, be we each would. other. <laughs> they still do it in Congo. Remember Lau Mel Lastman, the mayor of Toronto, had that commercial. Nobody. Well, they had the mayor's uh, convention, and it was in Congo. And Mr. Mel Lastman said he didn't want to go to Cal Congo because they still put people in pots and cook them and eat them. <laughs> and he got away with that. That's hilarious. And John Tory, he's getting away with playing with uh, little kids or little boys. We don't know the full story on that one. Chris Guy wants to run for mayor of Toronto. So Chris Guy wants to run for mayor of T.O. Oh, well, that's what we need, a regular person. But that Toronto mayor seat seen a lot of ass. I'll tell you. And crack. With uh, Rob Ford. And now John Tory, you know, if I was the next mayor, I'd change those seats in that office. <laughs> There's more semen probably in that office than the HMCS Hunter. I guarantee it. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, the, the, the FS Fitzgerald. There's a lot of semen in that office. <laughs> yeah, Chris Guy for mayor. There you go. Got my vote. Yeah, I'll move to Toronto. Yeah, got to move to Toronto, though. I don't know about that. Fuck. I, I can't even afford the west side of Windsor anymore. Too much of that. It's too expensive. Times are getting rough. Times are getting hard. It's going to get worse, too. Here comes your Easter fucking card, folks. It's only going to get worse. 
Seven dollars a gallon for milk. Seven bucks a gallon for milk. Some of that shit, yeah. That See that ten dollars a fucking dozen for eggs in California and Florida. That's nuts. People are if you suitcase and eggs across the border. Yeah, yeah, they're smuggling them. Yeah, yeah, they're smuggling in their keisters across yeah, the border. Better than drugs. Just to have eggs. They're hooping it. That's crazy. <laughs> Me run for PM? I guess that's the way. Me run for prime minister? Imagine me as a prime minister. The chicken I'd be the first guy thrown out for dropping the F bomb. Yeah, yeah, and then you can hire all your friends as you. I'd hire associates. everybody on my yeah. Facebook that says yeah. run. Yeah. And you'd all get paid $300,000 yeah. a year. And yeah. and you could just do all the fucking scamming you want. What's all the Because you got here? diplomatic any, fucking immunity. Yeah, know any insides and outs walk down to the. Oh, yeah. Oh, you want, you want to see corruption. I had the revenue department right two doors down. Just find out how you can scam more. You want to clean up the city of Windsor? Hire me as mayor. Fucking crime will go down. Dope, dilk, and I guarantee it. Because I'll be in control of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, isn't that something? Eh? Yeah, no, these fucking politicians that start out. And they got don't have fifty cents to rub together, but wind up with millions in the yeah, end. Yeah. Uh, conflict interest. Slightly. Slightly. Yeah. Nobody ever gets fucking. How do you make four hundred prosecuted million on a fucking PM salary, man? Like fuck off. Fuck. I okay. got a lifetime weapons ban for marijuana. Lifetime weapons ban, folks, for marijuana. So I can't even. And I served in the reserves, and I know a little bit about weaponry. We'll call them tools. Okay. I know how to shoot. I know how to load. But I can't have weapons for life because of marijuana. But if you're a fucking skin hound or a pedophile, you're abusing fucking women and old people, you don't get a lifetime's fucking ban on weapons, folks. Something wrong with that fucking picture, especially when my conviction for pot had nothing to do with weapons. There was no violence whatsoever. The system's broken as we know it. It's like fucking broke back mountain. Ugh. And I ain't getting fucked anymore. Ugh. And we do it blindedly without even knowing, right? So it is what it is. I'm just going to be peaceful as usual. I'm going to get my phone and as many fucking grills as I can today and get some interviews because we all have different different reasons why we're going to protest today. I'm all about the little guy. Richie Doopies, good morning. Yeah, I got to be about the little guy, the homeless. Okay, that's my biggest concern. You know, the, the suicides, the legal suicides. You know, you don't even have to have fucking mental yeah, illness yeah, anymore. It's okay if you, you want just, it, but yeah. You could just drop out of the race because you can't afford to feed your family anymore. And yeah. you're too proud to go rob a fucking bank and try and make ends meet. Terrible. It's disgusting. Right? It's disgusting. Canada's like a hotel. <laughs> What's they, a... The immigrants come in and they, you can check in and you can check out. It's terrible. Yeah, go figure. I feel sorry for the fucking immigrants that are enticed to come over here. Yeah, right. Not now. They don't know till you get here. Shit. Oh. Fuck, you look at... You're talking about liberal voters, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, well, that's what it is. It's yeah. trying to stack the deck. Yeah. Well, the house of cards is about to come down, my friends. And yeah, that's a fact, Jack. That's what Bates were for. He said next to resign, man. They already had. He has to call an election. And if if you're on my fucking social media platform, I don't give a shit what what platform you're on. If you're voting for NDP or liberal. Take yourself the fuck off my fucking social media. Because <laughs> uh, you're the reason why we're here where we are today. True that. You're the true ones to blame. That. So a vote for the uh, NDP is a vote for the liberals and vice 100%. fucking versa. 100%. Don't do it. As distasteful as I am with the uh, conservative party, I was at the convention, la- or uh, the Greek meet last week. He's better than what we have. Sounds Give like them the big majority. Knock out the two parties so they don't even have party yeah. status. Yeah. So they have no say anymore. 
drop your party name, get the fuck out of there, and run, okay, and run fast, and if the conservatives don't do what they say, bring in the PPC. Yeah. We're fucking anybody. Chris Guy. Fuck. Yeah, bring in Chris Guy. We need PPC run to run Ontario. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking, yeah. Independence. Get rid of Ford. Independence. Independence. It's funny how Ford hasn't been on Facebook lately, eh? I haven't seen him anywhere. Oh, yeah. He was... I haven't seen him anywhere. He was uh, admiring Krista Freeland the other day. He loves her. Oh, he? yeah. Fuck it. I haven't seen him on, on Facebook or anything, so... What a douche nozzle, man. Fucking Krista Freeland. Fuck off. Yeah, Freelander. She was uh, on Twitch car... yesterday, too. Yeah, when, Freeloader. Uh... She's on dope. Yeah, fuck that head. She's she got a Twitch man. on her, man. Like a... Yeah, the twitching vampire. You know, I don't like to make fun of people. Maybe she has Tourette's or something. I don't know. But, fuck, she's fucked up. And she's in control. Dylan Clarou, Craig White, a lot of people watching. Okay, I'm going to sign off now because we're outside of Kitchener. Stay tuned, 12 o'clock. You got the link. It's on here. Check it out. It's on on this Facebook for Mouth of the South YouTube. And I'll be going live roughly around nine, or around uh, noon today. I'll bring you the show as I see it. Ciao, guys.